From the east of the country to the west of the country, Kamlesh Sutar is joining us from Nagpur. Kamlesh, this particular, the third phase is going to be crucial for both the BJP uh, Shiv Sena combined as well as for the Congress NCP, especially for the Congress NCP, given the uh, recent hailstorm which affected parts of the area that are going to the polls on Thursday. Uh, well, indeed, Maruk, that's uh, one issue uh, local leaders are uh, stressing here on, particularly talking about whether we have seen uh, leaders like Narendra Modi and Rahul Gandhi visiting the suicide belt of weather, particularly the district of Yavatmal. Even uh, leaders like Raj Thakre, Uddhav Thakre and Asharat Pawar have been intensely campaigning in that region. And one of the core focus is the issue of farmers uh, here. Also, the BJP is riding on the Narendra Modi wave. In fact, Narendra Modi <coughs> was here two weeks before where he had held Chai Pe Charcha with the farmers uh, of Yavatmal in one of the village that is uh, affected uh, by the hailstorm. He visited hailstorm affected farmers. The BJP has uh, been strongly uh, riding on the uh, Modi wave. The Congress NCP uh, say that the development work is their agenda. Big faces of the Congress NCP are in say uh, CWC member and senior Congress leader Mukul Vasnik, uh, uh, Heavy Industries Minister Praful Patel. Uh, all uh, stalwarts, BJP's national president, uh, former national president Nitin Gadkari is also trying his luck for the first time. This is for the first time he will be contesting Lok Sabha elections. And since Nagpur uh, is the headquarters of RSS, a uh, lot is at stake for the BJP, particularly in Nagpur and also in the Vidar region. The Shiv Sena is contesting three seats uh, and uh, always uh, Shiv Sena has got good support from the voters in the past and they would like to retain that. Particularly this time, Raj Thakre for the first time has fielded a candidate uh, in constituency for Shiv Sena has fielded his candidate. So for the Shiv Sena, it will also be difficult to retain its vote base with Raj Thakre making a dent. And uh, for parties like the Congress and NCP, uh, BSP has been trying to find ground in the region. Let right. me tell you, last time in 2009, uh, some candidates of BSP polled uh, votes more than 1 lakh. So this time around, though BSP has lost some of its ground in the Vidar region, they would certainly damage uh, the Congress and NCP prospects in some of the region.